Hey, dispatch, I'm northbound about the smoke house. I think I might be behind that stolen full of oh. He's northbound, southbound side of the road. He's turning on McKnight. 19's in row. Oh, we're still on McKnight passing the uh, Tony Fifth. Somebody go to Old Bethel and see if we can cut him off. Anybody copy? 10 4 is on his way. Where are you at, Mike? Uh, we're on McKnight, headed towards Old Bethel. We just crossed the tracks. Yeah. He is running. I've got him lit up, lights and sirens. We're doing about 45, 40, 45. Denver. I'll be behind you in a minute. I'm going to move to the railroad track. Copy. White mail. Uh, got a light blue or gray hoodie on. Shaggy dark hair. Is he running with lights on that four Yeah, he's lit up. He's just obviously not stopping. No, I was asking, did he hit lights on that four That way I can see him before I run into him. Yes, he, he has the lights on on the full load. Tony, if you're coming up behind me, watch for deer. I've seen a few. There go. I'm crossing the pipeline out here now. All right, we're at Old Bethel. Looks like he finally stopped. He's coming back towards you, Tony. He cut it around on It's a white male. He's probably 16 or 17, looks like. Might be looking at him just a second. I'm here on the bridge. So we're still on McKnight, headed back towards 165. Logan, are you headed this way? I'm trying to get there. Where are you at? Coming through town. I'm coming up on Grayson Red Light. Which way do you, uh, you think I need to try to come in? Let's keep on 165. He turned around. We're headed back to the highway. So we're still on McKnight right now, though. We're coming back up on the uh, on the tracks. Looks like there's a train, though, so he may take off, try to get down beside the tracks. I believe that's going to be who we talked about, too. Yeah, I believe so. Well, no, that's not the, the one that lives on 843. All right, he's going down beside the tracks, headed towards Clark's. I, I can't go any further. Tony, where's the closest point to get to, you think? Uh, I don't know. Probably Clark's. Uh, is that where the bridges are on the south end of Clark? Temple. Yeah, I don't think he went far down there and stopped. Like, yeah, I don't, I'm pretty sure I watched him turn his lights off. Either that or... Uh, he got behind a tree, and I could never see him again. I didn't leave him much room, but I guess he had enough. Yeah, looking at the map, the next, next crossing is probably going to be in Clark if, if he decides to go that far. Yeah, he can't get that far. He's got to cross that creek up there first. Yeah, that's right. I watched him come off of the uh, uh, west side of 506. I'm fixing to be a uh, pass the Clark's turn off. Yeah, he might just pull in there. That's where I'm trying to head to. You still hurt the track, ain't you, Blake? If I'm uh, past, the, past that point, I'm trying to get out here where that bridge is, what we were talking about. Yeah, you still at the track, aren't you, Blake? I'm going to be. Turn it back around. No, I don't think he can make it this far up here myself. Tony, I'm getting out of the truck now. I'm at the bridge. I'm going to get out walk down the tracks to the last place I saw his lights and see if he ditched the full wheel. Is that one of y'all on McNutt? Ten, ten four, I just pulled up. I don't know where it goes to, but there's a trail, full of a trail out there that woods, I'm sure, somewhere. It's about where you saw him at, right? Yeah, I, I found a spot where he crossed this little uh, this little creek on this trail. It's just wide enough. I can't get across it on foot. Blake, do I need to get off the tracks and go towards Old Bethel? 
Uh, maybe. I don't I don't know where this trail goes or where it, you know, where it comes out at. Y'all are still on the west side of the railroad track, though. Huh? Yeah, we're uh, probably less than 100 yards in the woods from where he went in the woods at. And well, there's a road uh, that goes through there. He can go to from there, I imagine. Yeah, I, I found a little spot I could cross this creek at. I'm going to walk it a little ways just to see what I see. I believe I can hear the four wheeler. Well, that you, Logan, said you could hear. Yeah, I'm standing on the tracks facing. Uh, facing y'all, facing south. He's out to the right uh, at a southeast angle to you, all, as best I can tell. And, well, I'm going just around this curve. There's a gate here. And I'm going to stop and get back out there. You think I should head toward Joe Bethel, Tony? Uh, where I'm at, I can still have a full of sound like maybe he's stuck. He's revving it up weird. Is that what you could hear, Logan? Yeah, I can hear uh, between the highway traffic and that. I can just hear just rip up once or twice real good. I've come to a line this full of trail, and I'm not real sure which way he went. I can't find any track. Yeah, I don't hear you around here where I'm at. Yeah, I haven't heard it since since that last time he revved it up a couple times. So I said maybe he got stuck. I believe I hear it on the other side of the trail. I think I walk back towards my car. I definitely hear a four wheeler east of the tracks. Well, if he crosses the track, he can come out that Hartley Road because it comes in close to the railroad. Tim, are you still here? 1050, time I got back to my vehicle, I ain't heard him no more. Careful. Is anybody out on the highway in case he drives you back to 506? I'm headed that way now. I'm going to go down 506 once I get back out of here. Hey, y'all think y'all heard him ribbing it up? You think he could have been crossing the railroad track? I was thinking either he was crossing the tracks or uh, was trying to get back across this creek to where he could cross the tracks, one of the two. I'm going to Hartley and Micro Tower before I'm going. Tony, you got your phone with you? No, nah, I run out and left it. Six, are you on 506? I'm going to park at the end of the uh, road there to smoke out. See if he comes by. Four, I've got uh, six on the phone. He's at the old Bethel school. He said he could hear the full wheeler. Sound like it's still out in the woods out there towards the old Bethel. Blake got in here all that, what'd you say? Yeah, I got Logan on the phone. He said he could hear the full wheeler out at Old Bethel. He's sitting at the school. Said it sounded like it's still out in the woods out there somewhere. Then, oh, has everybody left uh, Mac Knight and the railroad cross? Yeah, but I'm finna go back. I, I come down here to the smokehouse, see if maybe he'd circle back and try to go to 506. Uh, then, boy, I was headed back there. Uh, I wonder if you can get across that track as steep as it is up, up through there. Is anybody on uh, Mac Knight Road? Uh, Micro Tower Road? No, I just left Micro Tower and, and Hartley. I'm coming back to the railroad track on Mac Knight. I seen a light look like it come from the woods on Micro Tower, but I don't know if that was you or not. Four. I'll go to the tracks if you want to, uh, I don't know, maybe stop there at the intersection of uh, Marker Tower and McKnight and Timothy, maybe go to 165 and McKnight in case it comes out through there. We'll have that whole area kind of uh, cordoned off. I'm, I'm here at the tracks now. Yep. Logan said he just hired him, said it sounded like maybe he made it back to the gravel and was getting on it pretty good. That's it, I hear it going through the swamp. He may still be back on that trail then, trying to make his way out. No, he's, uh, sounds like he's going through the swamp, uh, gonna come out by the railroad track there and kill him. 
Yeah, he's south of me down this track, uh, south of me, like he's going through the swamp road. Gonna come out just across the railroad as you go into Kelly, across the railroad and turn right. I'm headed there now. He's out of here and me up here now. He's he, he was headed toward Kelly though. Are you talking about uh, Hendrick Road right there where uh, lives? That where you talking about is going to come out at maybe? Uh, Ten four. That's where he's going to come out at. Probably don't they have a gate down at the end of it? Down by Neil's house? Uh, I'm not sure. I know they had some something in there. He could cross black by on that old bridge. He could ride a four wheeler across it. Devil. Don't think there's a gate in there. I think I drove down to it one time here a year or so ago. I can see his headlights. I'm at the railroad tracks in Kelly. He's coming down the tracks, looks like. I'm going to back off and black out and see if he turns off here on the highway. I'm looking at him coming down the tracks. I'm parked here at the storage sheds. Whoever that is, stop and black out. Black out. Turn your lights off. Tim, turn your lights off. Uh, headlights are flashing. Looks like maybe it died on him. He's trying to crank it or something. All right, he's moving again. Back this way, Tim. All right, st he's still coming this way, I think. No, I need to cross the track. Tail lights, tail lights, tail lights, tail lights. Tim, tail lights are going back the other way. See him? Yeah, he's done turn around. He's going back to north on the truck. East or west side? He's uh he's north of the crossing, headed back towards uh McKnight on the tracks. There's somebody in the yard shining a flashlight. That may have spooked him. Logan, are you still at school? I just turned around uh on the highway. I'm back on uh McKnight, headed to the tracks. So I'll be there in just a second. Devil. If he keeps coming, he'll uh, you'll be looking at it. How fast is he moving down the track? Not very fast. He, he can't really go very fast across some uh, cross ties. I'm here to cross him now. Yeah, I come as far as I could down this road, and I don't hear him anymore. This call said that four-wheeler is on Avenue A, not layered. Is she looking at the four-wheeler, or that was just the last place she saw it? Because it was on the railroad track. They said y'all went down the wrong road and that it's over there in front of their house. 10 4, I'm right here on Avenue A. I'll wait for one of y'all. That way we can go in there together in case she takes off running again. Yeah, I'll get to it and find out if he's still at it. 1097. I'm at the river tracks and down here on my, uh, no, the night, and I don't hear him yet. So he could be. Is he still at the four wheeler? We ain't found it yet. Hang on a second. I'm trying to find a good place to get in the woods here. Is it on the track still? I'm here with the four-wheeler now. Supposedly the kid's hiding in the woods. See if one of y'all can talk to Mr. and see which way he left it. See if she saw him leave it. Tim, if it's a place to go in over there, do it. Because there ain't nowhere to go in over here. It's too thick. I got the four wheeler right here. It's parked here. Uh, he said that uh, when he took off just a piece below his house, he don't know which way he went. Is it a red Honda Rubicon? It's red. I'm walking up to it now. He parked it on the west side of the track, so he may be over there on that other road that I was on earlier. Honda Foreman. Rubicon. Uh, the keys are in it. Logan, you coming down here? Just went around the curves here by your house. Come down to 843. Uh, come in from that end. I just run down there and come back. I'm back here. Railroad track now. All right, so I go down to where many went in earlier and come, and come back up to y'all? Tenfold, just in case he's trying to. Get there. 843 now. Well, we're looking at this bike. I don't think there's going to be nothing to process on it. Denver, it is off the track, though. Uh, about four feet. 
I'm gonna try to see if it'll run. Blake, did he have a white shirt on? Oh, some kind of hoodie or gray. I was scared. Logan, go ahead for it. When you come by that house, was that she had door open tonight? Ten four, it was. Ten four. Dispatch, we're off 1098 from Kelly. 10-4. I don't know if it's already been put on there, but the uh, stolen four-wheeler from yesterday afternoon has been recovered. Uh, four, has it? 10-4.